Hello everybody, uh, this is Clint here and um, uh, <laughs> this video we're going to be talking about eggs. Now, don't stop here if you think I'm just gonna rant, which I am, but look, I used to eat eggs um, religiously, like chronically every single morning I would have eggs, bread, lure pack, butter, um, literally I couldn't go without it. I could not go without it. I thought it was delicious. You know, uh, some days I'd have oatmeal, but the majority of the time I would have eggs because I just love that salty, textury goodness, you know. And I looked it up online back then and I was like, yeah, eggs are good for you, good for you. And all these health and fitness gurus are saying, yeah, eggs are great. You're watching Rocky, you know, down in the eggs. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, you know, so uh, I thought eggs were perfectly healthy. And, uh, you know, coming to this lifestyle, um, I'm hearing a lot about, you know, like fat and cholesterol and this and that. You know, I started to just do a little bit more research on eggs. And, um, yeah, so I'm looking up the RDA recommendation for the amount of cholesterol um, uh, that you can have. It's the recommended daily amount. And what I found was it says that 300 milligrams of cholesterol. This is what the this is what the recommended daily amount is, um, and eggs. Let me look at this. Eggs have a hundred and eighty five milligrams of cholesterol for one egg, just for one egg. That is already over half of what your recommended daily amount is for one egg. I mean. <laughs> If you eat two eggs, you're screwed. <laughs> so, so how did how did um, this become a health food? And I was also doing more. Like, let me look at this. So, um, it also has five point three grams of fat. But let's go back to this cholesterol thing, because human beings we already produce all the cholesterol we need in our bodies. So we're actually going out of our way to get cholesterol, which is stupid. <laughs> which is so stupid. This is the recommended daily amount for this thing that could eventually lead to like heart disease and clogged up arteries. And, you know, we'll compare that to a plant source. We'll compare that to a plant source. Lentils. For a cup of lentils, there's 17.9 grams of protein of protein minimal fat no cholesterol so <laughs> I'm just thinking really 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 just really just think about this guys <laughs> is eggs really good for you based on this I would say absolutely no you don't need it it's not good for you get rid of it you'll be leaner fitter stronger probably you have more energy Replace it with something that will give you energy in the morning. This is McClinton. Clinton. Have a wonderful day. Peace out. <laughs> oh, I love this. I love this. I love this.